Hi friends, welcome to biologyexamsforyou.com. Today we are having a very short video on difference between action spectrum and absorption spectrum of photosynthesis. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe and support this channel. Let's begin. First of all, starting with what are pigments? Pigments are chemicals that absorbs light rays from the visible region of electromagnetic spectrum. So this is a visible region that is from 400 nanometer to 700 nanometer. And this region is called as photosynthetically active radiation or PAR. And this region is absorbed by plant pigments like chlorophyll, carotenoids, xanthophylls, phycoerythrin, phycocyanin, etc. that are present on leaves. That is present in the organelle chloroplast that is involved in photosynthesis and the stacked one is called as grana and the individual unit is called as thylakoid. Let us zoom in this thylakoid. Now this is the zoomed in thylakoid. Now you can see this is the exact site of pigments in photosynthesis. Exact site of pigments in photosynthesis is the thylakoid membrane. The speciality of this pigment is this pigments can convert light energy into chemical energy during light reaction of photosynthesis. Now let us see what is action spectrum and absorption spectrum. First action spectrum was made by T. W. Enkelmann while studying on algae cladophora and we will be discussing that later. So action spectrum, this is an action spectrum, it's a graph showing the rate of photosynthesis at different wavelengths of light. Here we can see in the y axis there is rate of photosynthesis and x axis wavelength of light. So you can see here this is a peak and the first peak that is in blue region and this is a second peak that is in the red region indicating that maximum photosynthesis occurs in blue and red region. And here you can see this is a dip that is in the green region that is in the green region indicating that least photosynthesis occurs at the green region or green light is not at all absorbed by the pigment molecules. That's why plant leaf appears green as it reflects green light. So action spectrum is a graph showing the effectiveness of different wavelengths of light on photosynthesis. Maximum photosynthesis occurs in blue and red light. Absorption spectrum is a graph showing the absorption of different wavelengths of light by different pigments during photosynthesis. As the word indicates absorption of light by different pigments in photosynthesis. Here you can see, so for chlorophyll A and B, these are the prominent peaks. There is a peak at blue region for chlorophyll A and chlorophyll B and there is a peak at red region indicating that chlorophyll absorbs blue and red light. For carotenoids as you can see this is a, this yellow line is the carotenoid line. There is a peak at violet region and also at the blue green region. So it absorbs violet and blue green light. And this is the absorption spectrum. Here in the x-axis you can see the amount of light absorbed in the y-axis wavelength of light. So simply absorption spectrum is a graph showing different wavelengths of light absorbed by different pigments during photosynthesis. As you can see these two graphs coincides each other indicating that chlorophyll is the most prominent pigment that is involved in photosynthesis. Hope you are clear with this concept. Thank you so much for your support. You are with biologyexamsforyou.com.